Hey guys, what's going on? It's Ryan here. Welcome back to the channel. Now in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how you can actually create a really epic modded outfit using clothing glitches that work after the patch of 1.41 inside of GTA 5 Online. So if you do enjoy this video, please make sure you leave a like and hit subscribe and turn on notifications to get notified whenever I upload another video just like this. Well now, let's get straight into the video. Alright guys, so getting started on this modded outfit, all you'll need to do is make your way over to any clothing store on the map and go into the top section, go down to biker cuts and put on the same defender vest I do right now, which is the brush stroke defender vest. Then guys, once you've got that equipped, all you want to do is make your way over to the pants section and all you want to do is go into cargo pants and scroll down until you'll find the brush stroke cargo pants this is what it looks like right there so guys once you've got that equipped make your way over to the shoes section then guys all you want to do is go into the boot section and you want to scroll down until you find the moss tacked boots then guys once you've got those equipped make your way over to the hat section and scroll down the hat section until you'll find the combat helmets go into the combat helmets and scroll down until you'll find the brush stroke dual lens then guys all you want to do is just equip those and make your way over to the accessories Okay guys, so once you are actually in the accessories, go down to gloves and equip the brushstroke tactical gloves. And once you've actually done that guys, just go and save it as an outfit. Okay guys, so once you've saved it as an outfit, make your way over to the mask store. Go into the mask section, then guys, scroll down until you'll find the head scarfs and scroll down through the head scarfs until you'll find the brush stroke loose headscarf and guys all you want to do is just equip that and go and find any telescope it could be in your apartment or office or just on Del Perro Pier there's a lot of telescopes on Del Perro Pier so if you don't actually own a high-end apartment or an office just go to the pier okay guys so once you arrive at a telescope you want to do the telescope glitch run past your telescope spamming right on the d-pad and if done correctly your character should just stand right in front of it and if he does open the interaction menu go down to style accessories go down to helmets and put on the brush stroke dual lens as you can see right here from there guys once you've got all that equipped what you want to do is walk away from the telescope and the mask and the helmet should combine into one outfit and it looks really really cool as you can see right here now you can put the helmet visor up which means like the dual lens on the uh, on the helmet go up as you can see right there now guys we're going to do the same for the glasses you can use any glasses but guys just do the telescope glitch and it all should just disappear off your head the uh, the helmet and the mask and once you see that guys and your character's standing in front of the telescope all you want to do yet again open your direction menu go down to style accessories go down to glasses and put on any glasses of your choice it doesn't really matter i'm just going to use these ones so guys once you put on any glasses that you want walk away from the telescope and the glasses the mask and the helmet should all just combine into one outfit and it looks really really cool from there just go over to any clothing store on the map and save it as an outfit Alright guys, so this next part is really your choice, you can add face paint onto the outfit or not, it doesn't really matter, it's your choice, but if you're going to add the face paint on this outfit, make sure you do actually choose the kiss my axe one, as you can see this is what it looks like, it should be the first option under face paint. From there guys, once you've actually got that face paint on, leave the chair and make your way over to any clothing store on the map. Alright guys, so this next part you will need to have the night vision goggles without the mask and you'll need to save it as an outfit and as you can see right here, all you want to do is go into the outfit saved, go down to the outfit which has the night vision goggles on as you can see right there and all you want to do is just equip that outfit 
and go all the way up to the modded outfit you're creating right now and as you can see the night vision goggles should actually transfer over and you just want to equip the modded outfit we're creating right now and go and save it as an outfit. Alright guys, so this next part you will need to have a duffel bag saved on any outfit as you can see right here. And all you want to do is put on that outfit with the duffel bag saved on it. And from there, go inside any helicopter as you can see right here. And uh, all you want to do is just fly up really high with your helicopter until you can actually jump out of the helicopter and pull your parachute just in time before you hit the ground. So guys, as you can see, I'm just flying up into the sky. I'm going to jump out my helicopter and instantly pull my parachute. And then guys, once I've actually pulled my parachute and I'm gliding to the ground, I'm going to open my interaction menu, go into style, go down to outfits, and hover over my modded outfit I'm creating right now. So guys, once your character does actually land on the ground, all you want to do is wait for your character's right arm to go through the right strap of the parachute and as you can see once my character's right arm goes through the right strap I instantly equip the modded outfit and as you can see the duffel bag has actually transferred over to the modded outfit so yeah guys now run over to any clothing store and save it as an outfit alright guys so once you save the outfit all you want to do is go down to the flight suit section and all you want to do is equip the flight suit, which is the green flight suit, as you can see right here. Once you've got that equipped, guys, make your way over to the vanilla unicorn. Alright, guys, so once you arrive at the vanilla unicorn, make your way inside. And all you want to do is, once you're inside, open your interaction menu, go down to style, go down to outfits, and equip the modded outfit you're creating right now. And guys, when you do actually walk back outside, of the vanilla unicorn you will notice that a flight tube should appear on, on your chest on the outfit as you can see right there so from there make way over to the clothing store save it as an outfit and there we go you've created this really epic modded outfit so yeah guys hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please make sure you leave a like and hit subscribe and don't forget turn on post notifications to get notified whenever I upload another video just like this for the nap see you guys in the next video peace